I had a fantastic meeting with Amir uh, on the price for the new statue. Uh, it's, very, it's very pricey, so uh, I'll see how I can accomplish that feat. It would be uh, six meters, 18 feet high. It would be fantastic. Um, and he, he guarantees TV coverage and the government coming out and whole ceremony and what have you uh, in Hadamar, which would be fantastic. Uh, now I'm in Nabik and I'm at the Mikani uh, restaurant. The, uh, where Migo, uh, my newest ambassador, has a fantastic sushi restaurant. Well, he says it's not a sushi restaurant, it's just a regular restaurant, but I had sushi for the first time, it was delicious. And I just noticed their sign out here for three mini burgers, but I'm going to do a fantastic burger challenge again at Makani here in Namek. So stay tuned for the fantastic burger challenge. Um, people seem to like them, you know, it's, it is what it is, it's for laughs. Uh, these videos are meant to entertain you, and I'm getting some comments that it is entertaining, so that's what, that's what it's all about. Smiling, laughing, enjoying life. We live in a stressful time right now. But again, stress is all your fault. You can ignore the stressful situations, um, and sometimes they don't affect you, but you're letting them affect you. So uh, try to reduce your stress by smiling, by saying the word fantastic. Watch it, it really does work. So stay tuned for the uh, Fantastic Burger Challenge, and uh, from Navic up here, uh, just about a, a half a mile from the bus stop, which um, is uh, my favorite uh, Ambassador Adley's uh, restaurant. He has a couple different locations, and uh, Navic's a pretty big place, um, and huge, huge resorts, Rix's, a few others. So stay tuned, everyone. Outside. Everybody, welcome to another fantastic burger challenge. Excuse me. I'm in Nabek, um, Tramache, and we're at Makani, um, the second location I've been at. I tried your sushi. So, here's, here's how it's, it's going to happen. Beautiful atmosphere, very clean restaurant. One of the, one of the cleanest restaurants I've seen in, in, in um, the area. I know for a fact, because I know the owner, that they make everything with love and care. And supposedly, these are not french fries. Natural? Yeah, it's the same natural. Yeah. <laughs> Getting ketchup? Okay. So it's all natural ingredients. So I'm told that they look like fries and they taste like fries, but maybe they're not. So, it's very fair price. It's 55. But as you can see, it comes with fries. Let me read this in. There you go. I don't have a cameraman today. Again, it's, it's a sesame bun, with some, with some kind of mayonnaise on it. It's a fairly good sized burger. It's got tomato and, and, and lettuce. I'm not sure the sauce there. And then I gotta give them another demerit because they didn't ask me how I wanted to cook. The bun's a little chewy, a little chewy. I'm not sure about the sauce that's on it. Everything can't made here. It's a bit on the dry side. And it's well done. The bun, for some reason, is chewy. And they could use some ketchup and mustard. I'm going to have to give it a, it's a good size. Came with fries. I'm going to have to give it a um, 6.8. I'm sorry, just, it's not, it's not thrilling in here. Sometimes all natural things, for me anyway, aren't always fantastic, you know. I need some salt and pepper in this. Anyway. From Connie, I might turn it back on if things change. Oh, here comes some ketchup. Do you have mustard too? Mustard? Yeah. Mustard? Mustard? 
Must be. No, no. Let me ask you: Are these French fries, potatoes? Not French fries. Not French fries. It's another kind of French. What is it? It's a. We bring. A, we bring a special potatoes. Have a stro- not same. Okay. Uh, like uh, fat, like this. Okay. okay. And we have a special homemade. Uh, 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 crunchy, right? So, okay. Okay. We put it. We put potato in in this uh, sauce, right? And put again in oil. Okay. Okay. So you found this test. Very good. Tasty. Very tasty. Okay. Thank you. And uh, about beef, because also beef we bring beef and we make everything homemade here. Everything's homemade, bread. as he's saying. Yeah. Also bread. This is our bread. You make the bread yourself? Yeah. It's a little chewy. Chewy. Ah, you want the more soft? Well, mm. it is what it is. I mean, I'm just saying it's, it's chewy. You know, it's not chewy. Chewy. Ah. I don't know how to say it in uh, your language. Mm-hmm. Okay. Good. Complete and we'll speak again. Thank you. Thank you. Anyway, from Connie and Nabek, be fantastic, everyone. Talk to you soon. Okay, <clears throat> I'm back. Mustard and ketchup added it, added the, the, the hamburger flavor to it. Because their sauce wasn't a lot of it on it. Nice presentation. The fries are delicious. Um, and there's no onion. I, I believe a hamburger should have onion. And you should always ask how you want to cook. But uh, it's carboiled, which is nice. Burgers should be carboiled. And it's getting more moist as I get through it. So it's not, I might have to give it a, a 7.2. 7.25. You can't always have a cameraman. Sorry, guys. <laughs> 